What's going on, boxing fans? Joan Williams here at the distance, part two of my post fight video for Paul Williams versus Kermit Centron. And me, um, what I did was when I first made my video, and what I usually do on my videos is I turn around and when I look at the fight, I really don't look at replays that much. I just make a determination of what I see and really don't look at the replays. But, you know, anyway. I did get to take a look at Gambino's video and I looked at other videos and then I do have it on DVR um, what happened in the fight um, between Centron and Williams and it did look like Centron took a jump um, at towards the um, when he hit the ropes it did look like he took a jump or took a dive or whatever a literal dive and overall you know something that has been questioned throughout the career of Kermit Centron something that has been said throughout his whole entire career ever since the fight against Antonio Margarito is his heart you know is he and some people have said he's an underachiever and whatever but you know taking a look at the fight once again and me being as thorough as I can be and I'm always and I try my best to be as thorough as I can be he did take a jump because you know it's not like he literally just fell out of the ring you know um it just seemed as if he took a took kind of a dive outside of the ring and actually it looked like he didn't want to continue in the fight which is total bullshit because if you want to be in the sport of boxing then you know you have to have heart Sorry about that, but still, you know, something that you have to have in the sport of boxing is you do need something that we call heart. And Kermit Centron doesn't possess that. We've seen it in the Margarito fight. We've seen it in the Sergio Martinez fight. Kermit Centron does not have heart. And, you know, if you look at the, at the Sergio Martinez fight, you know, you saw him complaining. You saw him down. You actually seen him lose the fight not only once but twice in that fight lost actually straight up lost the fight this fight you know in my opinion he did lose he did lose the fight because it just seemed to me that he didn't want to continue um because Williams started to pull it on and you know I guess it was his way out and you know and I, and I guess he was thinking he won the fight I'm, I'm guessing he, he was thinking since he was doing pretty well in the fight. I thought, you know, maybe Centron, this is maybe what Centron was thinking. Maybe he was thinking he won the fight. And if he took that dive, maybe he has a victory over Williams and he can go on and do bigger and better things. Maybe that was within the mind frame of Kermit Centron. But at the same time, you know, who knows what Kermit Centron was thinking, but. That lack of heart tonight is showed um, to to myself. You know, you could talk about the ropes um, or whatever. I think the ropes were just fine. I just think that now looking at the replays, looking at all the other videos, Gambino, Blood Boxing, Boxing Fan Four, um, and then looking at the replays through observation, you know, it's pretty obvious that Kermit Centron could have continued the fight, and he didn't fight. Um, and really, I think in situations such as these, you know, this is where true champions are made of. You know, Kermit Centron's injuries, I don't believe are that bad or that serious. Um, if you look at certain fights in the past, you look at and you see the certain heart of certain fighters. Um, you know, um, one one of one example, Danny Williams. Danny Williams fought with a broken shoulder blade a couple years ago fought with a broken shoulder blade and continued fighting um, Andre Burr a few weeks ago fought with a messed up bicep continued fighting Roy Jones fought with a broken hand Floyd Mayweather Jr. fought with a broken hand Arthur a Abraham fought with a broken jaw and t you can't tell me that this fall that Kermit Centron took was as bad as these injuries because these men had broken bones and they continue fighting and you know overall and overall you know Kermit Centron something that he lacks is heart and tonight he's proved it so me um, I'm not gonna take my other video down you know I'm just gonna respond to this last video 
But Kermit Centron did indeed take a dive. He did indeed quit and deserved that loss. So, anyway, that was the distance. Thanks for watching. Peace.